we've got two schools who have been involved in this project since the start. We've got Taylor Road and we've got um, Hazel Primary School. We did an intervention with uh, year three pupils, which are now year four. Um, and the idea was really to, how can we, can we really influence their, um, their, I suppose, their attitude, their behaviours to not only sport, but also uh, healthy living. We want them to really look back on the, this year of taking part in activities with the different clubs as something they, they has made a difference to their kind of childhood. So as part of the programme, each sporting club has given some uh, sporting equipment for them to use. So today we've got some basketballs and we've got some cricket sets going out to them. This project's really um, important, the, um, obviously with the childhood obesity and the increased risk of diabetes in sort of this population. Um, this United Leicester project's really good at trying to help tackle that from different angles. So uh, we work at the Leicester Diabetes Centre and we help with um, helping people establish like, healthy lifestyles and getting them involved in physical activity. So by this United Leicester project, it's helping those like school children, starting them young, getting them interested and energised. And by using the, the professional sports clubs, it gives it a different angle. Like People are passionate about it, it's interesting, it's exciting to the children. And if they're interested in it, they're more likely to sort of do something about it and carry on with it. So the children haven't just had an aspect of one sport, they've got an idea of lots of different sports in PE. The after school club and lunch time clubs so are even extra uh, time doing physical activity. They've also worked on um, their food choices in class, so it's given some idea about their food choices at home. And then they've also worked on sort of their life skills and their resilience in class as well. So we've also been invited to come watch some professional games, which is really good for the children because although the, a lot of the sports venues are on their doorstep in Leicester, they some of them weren't aware of some of them that were here. So a lot of the children knew about the football. They may not have been to a rugby game ever before. They may not have been to uh, the Leicester Riders Arena before. So hopefully that's going to increase um, more participation in that, that sport, but also to come and watch the professional games to inspire them in the future. I've enjoyed it a lot. Uh, I've been doing this since year three. Um, I think I sometimes I'll play football when I'm older because I really enjoy it and maybe some basketball. It's been really exciting obviously getting these the main sports clubs together um, and really providing opportunity for children. Um, quite a short focused group but um, really hard hitting agendas around health and I think to be involved in that and actually see the change throughout the years has been awesome. Having been shut down for so long it's, it's been really exciting to be able to engage and, and find an area that we all have shared interest in through United Leicester. Being able to see different demographics engage in rugby um, and not just rugby but all the four and five sports that we're involved in. Um, getting the guys to come to, to games that they want to see and to, to play other sports they want to do and whilst playing those sports actually being able to get healthy and fit and understand how to do that is really really great and from a Tigers Foundation point of view that's, that's the bill and end all for us. When the United Leicester project came back into school it, we managed to organise everything being COVID secure and they, they got straight back in with the kids, built those relationships and given these children that uh, push back into sport that they needed um, and hopefully they'll continue that through the summer holidays. Like with Covid and all, especially the children, they've had so much disruption to their sort of education and all their fun sort of activities so I'm so pleased that the coaches have been able to get back into the schools to finish off the United Leicester programme this, um, for this term um, and also come together in this celebration event.